They're off, dashing Roger, anything but dashing, leaving stall five. He often misses the break and he has to drop in in rear in the light blue. And through the first couple of hundred yards of the King Richard III Cup, it's the nose-banded Wob 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 who leads up to Alexander James in a black and red jacket and short price favourite Al Mubia under Will Buick and the dark blue settles in behind the leading pair as they go into the turn. Uh, then May Song in a sheepskin nosebound in fourth to Bo Pedro in a white jacket against the running rail. Dashing Roger from that sluggish start has made up a place. An Aryan power in the King Pass helps under Ryan Moore, the blue and white, looking on from last place as they uh, free wheel down the hill towards the end of the third furlong. Wob, wob, wob against the rail, now being pressured for the lead by Alexander James. Almobia covered up on the inside of May Song entering the home straight. Uh, then Bo Pedro in a white jacket away to the right, dashing Roger in the pale blue. And Aryan Power, the last on straightening as they move through halfway. Alexander James in the black and red right alongside Wob 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 in the hands of Lee Roach. May Song in the noseband, poised in the slipstream of the leading pair. Almo Beer in the dark blue covered up against the running rail as they pass the three. Bo Pedro's being ridden along, dashing Roger yet to be asked a maximum effort. More beginning to coax away on Aryan power as Wob 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 kicks on, climbing for the last quarter of a mile. Alexander James weakens away swiftly. Buick has pulled out Almobir now in the dark blue and he's launching his challenge. May Song coming with them. Few others landing a blow in behind. Almobir strikes the front just outside the furlong. It's tough work in rain softened conditions, but the short price favourite is in front now from Wob Wob Wob. May Song in third, then Aryan power. Buick having to nudge away to make sure but Almo Beer is extending away in the shadows of the post and he's going to run out a ready winner of the King Richard III Cup. Wob, wob, wob in second, gave it a good go. May Song third and Aryan Power uh, followed home by dashing Roger. Long breaks to Alexander James and Bo Pedro last of all. Well, Alma Beer has won our feature race here today, the first running of the King Richard III handicap, and uh, Will Buick uh, remains unbeaten on this horse now, and back in slightly calmer waters, a, a better setup for him. It was, looked quite straightforward for you. Yeah, it was, you know, from, from where we were drawn, and obviously he does handle this ground, although I don't think any horse really wants the ground as deep as, as it is here today, um, but he handles it better than most, and, you know, it's set up quite nicely for him, and I think, you know, he, he's still a relatively light race, so I think there's there's... You know more to come for for him to learn and and you know he's he's still got potential he's a, a horse that looked like he was doing some of his best work late on on that testing going conditions and he looked at in the lincoln that he could benefit from a step up is that the kind of thing things you're thinking in your mind that he could benefit from a from a slightly further in time i'm not quite sure what what what, what they're thinking but um you know certainly I, I would be happy with him at a mile because he's more likely to get a, a stronger pace to follow and but look he, he might improve in time and um, and maybe minor quarter will be will be something that's within his reach I know I know he ran he, he ran over minor quarter a couple of times last year so you know it's uh, it's, it's it's there for him I guess yeah, as a son of Frankel you know these horses that they, they do benefit from time and experience and education and William Haggis is so good at sort of finding those right races for him so he probably will be given the, the right setup over the course of the season just to find his feet at whatever level it might be yeah exactly and, and like I said I, th I think he's still got plenty of potential so you know he's a horse that can only improve okay well well done thank you very much thank you.